What is happening guys? It's been a long time since I've done one of these videos, but I'm going to show you guys how to find some cool flash drives, some good loot, and all these other things without dying in a PMC. Risk-free loot and escape from Tarkov. I've done this the last couple of wipes, but now that the Shoreline expansion is here, Shoreline has become a super, super profitable uh, way to scav um, with, with a bunch of... Uh, with a lot more loot spawning as you can see my scav is going to be coming in with very little gear uh potentially no ba uh, a burke and a bank robber and we're going to make 600,000 rubles minimum all right we spawned in a okay spot they spawned me in the, probably one of the spots that just does not get the most amount of loot Ooh, <laughs> all right, all right, okay, the game's not fucking me yet, so. So we spawned in with a fucking red flare, so we're going to get, we're going to get something, dude. We might be in this lit raid a little bit longer than I anticipated, but. Here we have a weapon crate. So let's get that going. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So that's the loot we're talking about. That's gonna get us the big up. All right. That is a really good zone, so we'll probably head there next. It is pretty early in the end of the raid, so I'm expecting heavy resistance here. There's usually some pretty good stuff on this toolkit if it spawns. Now, elite players are going for a lot of money. Tools we want. Um, we're going to keep this in case we find a rail. Um, e wires, wires, P gauges. Uh, stuff you'll find a lot of common stuff. Uh, uh, like engine parts, motor parts, whatever the hell those are. Those go for a lot of money on the flea right now. There's, they're worth a lot. Like 20k each on the flea market. Um, so I would definitely incentivize you guys finding those to be successful. Um, we're going to head to this way and obviously keep your eyes on the surroundings. You're a scab with a fucking shotgun. So if anything is about, I don't know, 50 meters out, you're probably going to die. Now that I have this AK, I can do a little bit of damage, but... Super expensive, but they're worth it. BCP FMJ, it's not too terrible. One by one scope, nice. These crates want quite a bit of tech loot in it. Tech loot. Probably looted. That's probably sniper scav, possibly. Armor. Beautiful. I needed that. Hoses go for pretty well money on the flea too, especially the early white. You're gonna want to try and grab all this stuff that you can flee as much as possible. So we probably should be good to go out here.
Doesn't like level four rig. Lot of like suppressors on this table. There's a dead scav down here at the firing range, typically a weapon crate. Um, looks like there's some. There's some more crates and stuff inside here, but we're gonna loot this first. Let this go for some pretty good money. I'm gonna throw that stupid. Got these shelves. Got some weapon boxes. Ooh, these are worth some money. That's probably not worth as much as I think it is. Those are going to be some big money. We'll pack that in too. Uh, FAL mags. You can use it for the uh, um, SA58. Shit like that. Usually 20 rounders. You don't find those very often. Veritas. Pick. Throw that out. Grenade launchers, you can't flee, but they're they're priceless. They're like 30k if you're gonna sell them to vendors. Do you feel on here on the table? I mean, this is this is just, this is just the start, boys. I keep the nose for a minute until I need it. We still got a red flare, so we need to find a bigger backpack or a bigger rig. Ooh, we gotta swap that. That's not really gonna be worth that much money. There's jackets all over the place, which is nice. Matches, they ain't worth that much. Bulbs are worth some money. That's where the money's at, baby. I'm telling you, dude. This fucking expansion, they dropped the best gear in this fucking one spot. This is the new, the med, this is the new med tent, though. This is where everyone's fighting. So I'm surprised to see this is as looted as it is. Extra like 15k, it's gonna outweigh that. I just spawned another thing there. A lot of like loose spawns. So we're trying to get some XP. A lot of looses. Oh my god, this cat scared the fuck out of me. Jesus. Hard drive. Some tech spawns in here, too. I gotta be hitting somebody else's shit up. There's no way that this shit is that empty. Oh, it just didn't spawn in all that good shit. Rings. There's buckwheat. All oh, that's always worth some money. So I don't know what I want to drop. That. I think we're good here. We can go further. Chunk of max energy. And then the 
and sanitary is right there. We are going to hit towards car extract though, so let's go back through here. Let's go hit that dead scab. No, we are going to pick up that can of chunk. That's worth some big money right now. I forgot. Those are like 25-30k. Obviously, your results may vary. What do I want to get rid of? Morphine's probably not worth that much. We haven't even hit up the admin building yet. That smoke's worth like 15k, so if I have something to swap out, I'm gonna keep that. That's gonna be good. That'll get me up the full everything. We'll take that condensed milk, make another 15k. Got bolts here too, we can make that. being open means that this should most likely have been all looted. But like I said, we got the flare, so get this down right. Second floor, lots of PC spawns, so pretty high chance for GPUs, for CPU fans, stuff if you're looking for quest items. And if DVDs are worth some money, but not based on the amount of slots I have right now. And PC core, those are worth some money, but I don't think anything that outweighs two slots of these. Hexagon suppressors worth some money. Is it better than these two, though? Can you go back? So far, garbage, garbage. Yeah, door was open doesn't necessarily mean that this has been fucked over. I don't know, maybe it is. I'm gonna check these offices. Pretty well, I think. Mm -hmm. land. Mm -hmm. That's what, like 20k. 
versus like 17. It was mid maxing at this point. Not the hard part. AC gun suppressor is probably worth a lot of money, but I kind of don't think that's the most. Maybe, maybe we're in luck here. really all we can grab. Okay, 101. That was the absolute most ass airdrop I've ever witnessed. That's that. Let's round up the loop. We gotta take a shit. All right. So after fleeing and selling to traders and all that kind of shit, we have made eight hundred and thirty-nine thousand rubles. That's fucking insane. That's just the amount of loot and mid-maxing possibilities in 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 shoreline. And we'll do another run with the uh, with the duo and see how much money we both make. Yeah, same. I'm not even in yet. Yeah, big up. Yeah, peanut butter and jelly, SJ1. Peanut butter and jelly? Huh? E and D. It's not peanut butter and jelly, I just call it peanut butter and jelly. What the fuck did I pick up all those? Chat. Spawn in with. Did they finally. I got finance office key. Not bad. Dorm 105. AP 300 blackout. You have dorm 105? Yeah, Bird? is that good? Blue or? Blue. Damn, that's a pretty good key. It's like 400 k I need to get out. You don't need to get out. You got the rest of the loot. I fucking ran through the entire raid last raid. With it. Fucking three hundred thousand dollar key in my inventory the entire game. It's actually nineteen K? What are you talking about, bud? Oh. Or maybe it's one oh one oh one oh four I'm thinking of. 
Yeah, my game's running a lot better. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely updated. Um, so I normally get like 30 to 40 FPS. I'm getting like average of 50. Is that you running past me? I don't know. You have a... I'm in like a little... I have a sling. A shotgun. No, it was a scav. I think had, that guy had a Mosin. Yeah, there is. Oh, someone oh. pulled an airdrop. I might as well just go towards it. Why is it juicy? Oh, never mind. That shotgun looked pretty juicy to me. But it's really not. It just looked, looked like it. Here's my gun in this crate. Come on. Oh, it's possible. Idea rig. That's fine. That works. I could throw shit in here. Rock him with a shovel, brother. Strike, strike, hump back. Good job. Yeah, I need uh, it. This map. I and have only, I've only gone woods and woods. And like, interchange. I've gone woods like three times. Custom. I gone once. woods a couple times, and then I did ground zero once. Oh yeah. I haven't done customs yet. I, I think, don't think I, at I think, least. I think I've done the one on, on, uh... Where'd you go? Uh, I'm on, in the, I'm inside the first building. Where did you walk in? Dead scab had 7 and 42. Yeah, I just went some weird way, bro. Holy shit, he was fucking thick. Breaking the window. Oh my god, I can't even jump through the window. Shit! What? <sighs> He's got armor and shit. Take that bag, though. I'm rough. I'm not making it. There you are. Tried. No energy. You just go downstairs into the basement. And then you just go off to the right. No, 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 thank you. I'm not making it. What do you mean, how are you? That's why I told you not to get greedy, brother. Just go down the stairs off to the right. You should be able to get out. Oh my god. Maybe like milliseconds away. I made, goddamn, seven hundred and twenty-three thousand without selling my stims. 
So I'm at fucking almost nine million. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Yikes. Seven hundred forty thousand! Holy shit! Holy shit! This swag boy out. Time to flee. And a one point four million ruble fucking run if I did not have to turn that GPU in. That is fucking crazy, dude. Jesus Christ. Shoreline is the best fucking map to short, uh, scav on. I promise. <laughs> 